Searching for answers to fight flooding in Dewey Beach. Good evening, I'm Charlie Sakaitis. And I'm Christina D. Robertis. Welcome to Coast TV News at 11. We begin tonight with a new infrastructure project that hopefully will hold off rising waters in one of our coastal towns. Flooding is a familiar scene in Dewey Beach, but the town has a new plan to prevent water from filling up roads, yards and property. As Coast TV News reporter Brendan Conroy shows us, Dewey officials are confident this new project will make a difference. Flooding. It happens a lot here in Dewey Beach, but the town is being proactive. They have a plan to help fix the problem and hold storm waters at bay. Residents' quality of life will be vastly improved over what it is today. Robert Palmer with Beacon Engineering presented an infrastructure plan to the town Thursday, and he is confident it can get the job done. With regard to the um, storm flooding in locations such as this, yes, absolutely. This solution will, will absolutely solve the problem. Palmer wants to install two infiltration trenches underground on Jersey Street. The project will cost around $45,000 total for the trenches and will not interfere with the sewer systems. Daryl Helms has lived on Jersey Street in Dewey Beach for 13 years. He says floods in Dewey happen a lot. I'd say we get about, um, it just depends on the rainstorms, but I would say you have three or four floodings a year. This year was a little less, quite honestly, because of how dry it was, but we're just waiting for it to come back. And with the hurricane coming up the coast, who knows? Thursday's presentation wasn't in front of the full town council, but that is where it's headed next. So while there won't be a fix immediately, Maybe that's okay. Rome wasn't built in a day, but you'd rather be in Rome than Atlantis. Now, it's important to note that they're going to be underground, so they won't be in the way of cars or pedestrians. And the town realizes that this isn't something they can fix in a day, but they're taking all the precautions necessary to make sure flooding stays at a minimum. In Dewey Beach, Brendan Conroy, Coast TV News.